Beverly Hills Unified School District has announced new reopening dates for TK through second graders and third through fifth graders. However, Beverly Hills Education Association believes that this announcement violates the Memorandum of Understanding, or MOU, signed back in December. According to the recent announcement from the school board president, Mrs. Rachel Marcus, TK to second graders will be returning to physical campus on March 4th, while children in grades 3 to 5 will be back on the campus on March 8th. These plans were released shortly after the statement from the Los Angeles County Public Health officials that it is safe to return to an indoor learning environment. The county increased the case rate limit to 25 to reopen elementary schools, meaning that elementary schools are technically allowed to return back to school at this time. Although students have been cleared to return by public health officials, the Beverly Hills Education Association, the union for BHUSD teaching staff, have protested openings by arguing that returning to school would be a breach of the MOU between the union and the district. The agreement said that the adjustable case rate must be between 7 and 10 per 100,000 people before students are allowed to go back. The union has viewed the act of reopening schools as an injustice to both children and teachers since they believe that going back before case rates decrease puts them in harm's way. On the other hand, the district believes that it is necessary for children to return to school and not allowing them to do so would breach the children's constitutional right of be given a sufficient education. Ms. Elena Castanon, the president of the BHEA, stated that the school board and the union agreed that schools would reopen when, quote, adjusted case rates were below 10. She further stated that, quote, the district is now repudiating the agreement and directing teachers to return to work while adjusted case rates are higher than the parties had earlier agreed to. Dr. Michael Bregge, superintendent of schools at Beverly Hills Unified School District, issued a statement last Wednesday that said, quote, the district will respond accordingly after the BHEA filed formal legal action against the district in relation to our physical reopening of elementary schools. Dr. Breggi also assured parents that, quote, elementary reopening dates remain unchanged. We asked Dr. Breggi about the district reopening campuses and what he thinks about the BHEA's claim. I think the, the one thing for um, uh, people to remember what's most important is that for the last year, we've always been planning on going back and returning to school. From the very first moment we were closing uh, last March, April, um, we've always been looking for that, that opportunity to reopen when it's safely. So I think that's really important for people to remember because um, that's always been our goal. Um, even though we've got an agreement to help us uh, reopen safely, it's been, always been our goal. Our biggest challenge has always been that we have to navigate our way through what the state says and then what the county says. And then we have to kind of navigate our way through there and we've experienced hundreds of changes to the state and county plan over the last year. So um, I, I understand when there's concern and there's questions about how we are navigating our way through, but two things that are really most important that we've been extremely consistent on since day one, that is both the association and the school district, our goal is to get back into as much of a traditional setting as possible physically on campus. And also that we apply all of the guidelines from the state and the county in all of our work, uh, no matter how often it changes. Despite the conflict between the district and the BHEA, many students are eager to get back into the classroom after nearly a year of online learning. Students want what's best for our safety and education. From KBEV 6, I'm Grace Suomi.